Hello, I just want to give you a quick heads up about how you can use a tool called Powtoon. Um, it's basically a glorified um, presentation software, but it is quite cute. And um, and I think that there are, it, it has its time and place. I wish it was kind of a more full-featured kind of animation suite, but, you know, the version, it's free, the version of it I'm going to show you. Um, you can actually make videos up to five minutes, and I'll show you what the limitations are, but it's actually pretty good. So, you need a username and password, obviously. I think you can log in using your Google account and Facebook, but that might not be good for school. Or I think you can just set up a login. So there you go, I'm, I'm logged in up here. Um, you can actually pick all kinds of kind of pre-made presentations. And actually what I'll do is I'll show you one of those. Um, so let's have a look at, at this one here, the number one candidate. So we're just opening this up and you could just go in and change it so it's got your information in it. I don't actually use Powtoon this way, but I actually think it's a pretty good way um, to start using it because um, it's got a good selection of, of transitions and so forth. So there you go, it's loading up. It takes a little bit longer than I'd perhaps like and it can be particularly slow at school. But, um, but it'll be loaded in no time and then we can start working. And I'll show you what you can do. So here we go. So there's, there's your animation. You've got over this side, on the right hand side, you've got all the little tools like clip art. And over here, you've actually got them slide by slide. So what I'm going to do is show you just what this looks like, because they're very, they're quite schmick. So you go. Okay, so there we go. So you know, you've got quite good things with the hands. It actually feels quite organic. And so you're editing them slide by slide. So here's what I'm going to do. I actually like to start from the beginning, but, um, but you know, you might not. In fact, I'm not even sure that my choice is sensible there, but you might like to. So I'm just going to start with a blank presentation. And here it is loading, and it should load a bit quicker this time because I suspect that a bunch of the resources are already loaded. So I'm going to be, I think, presented with a white screen and, again, all of these things. Now... I can use the, the style here, or if you notice, I'm clicking through to different styles. Now, the ones with more are only there if you pay for them. Uh, the one that I quite like has kind of vaguely cartoony people. Here it is with this dude with the light bulb. So here I am. I've got three slides, and here's how it works. I'm going to pick one of my moving people. I'm going to pick the screaming dad. I love the screaming dad. I'm going to plonk him over there. And then I'm going to give him some text. And my favourite text is the handwriting text. So I'll drop it in there. And this is all very much like PowerPoint, if truth be told. And now I'm going to edit the text. Help, I'm in Omara's animation. Full stop. Pop it in. And there we go. So what you can see is, I've down the bottom here, I'm going to bring him in at half a second and I'm going to have him popping up. I'm going to have him disappearing in a fade at the end, and I'm going to have the text coming in for all that time. So let's see what it looks like. I click on this little um, circle here to play my animation from the beginning. There we go. Help, I'm in Omar's animation. And as you can see, I probably only need about the first five seconds of that, so I'm going to use these little buttons here on the timeline to trim it down to, say, six seconds. And here's something else I'm going to do. I'm going to go into my text and I'm going to clip out help. So I'm just, I'm in Omar's animation. So that's fine. And just stick with me here. I mean, he's not going to say that till two seconds. So I'm moving that. And what I'm going to do is put another piece of text in up here. And I'm going to go for what I think of as kind of punchline word. So help. I'm going to make it bigger. So 110 points. And I'm going to give it a more serious looking font. You know, the Beethoven one, oh, actually I find that a bit hard to read. Shermlock I quite like. Or Shermlock it might be, yeah, Shermlock. There, and I'm going to have that coming in at, say, one second. So you can kind of have keywords jumping out at your audience. So I'll start it again, and you can see what that looks like. Help. Okay. Yeah, that's all right, it's probably still a little bit long. So I'm going to go back and chop it down to five seconds. And what else am I going to do? There was something else about it that was bothering me. Let's see, when's that text start? One second? That starts at two seconds. I reckon that's going to start at one and a half. So let's have another look. Yep, that's better. And you've got time to read it before it goes on. 
I can add in all sorts of pictures coming and going. I've got quite a lot, you know, I can have, um, and they're in different styles too. See, this one's got a smartphone here. But if you go into different styles up in that menu, you've actually got different types of graphics. So let me just show you, see this guy I quite like. And he's got kind of hand-drawn type graphics. And you can mix and match them. And you can have them coming and going. As I said, it's not fully featured animation, but it's, it's pretty schmick. Then when you get to the end, you just publish it. So I hit the publish button. You can even kick it over to YouTube, which is what I do. Or you can just have it on the Powtoon site. Um, so I'm actually not going to publish that because that's fairly silly and I couldn't be bothered. But it will take you through to a page where it shows you that movie. Um, and you can share it with people. So that's Powtoon. I hope you find it useful. I certainly think it's, it's got its uses. I wouldn't want to use it for everything. And it is a bit playful rather than terribly serious. But um, you should get something out of that.